Now, New York's number one news, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. Parts of the tri-state area see the first measurable snowfall in years. A winter storm moved through the area, and in some locations, the storm dumped several inches of snow. I'm Anthony Carlo in West Milford, New Jersey, where the snow is creating for some treacherous road conditions and also giving snow lovers a lot to smile about. I'm Lucy Yang in Monroe, Orange County, where it has been snowing all night and the snow is leaving its mark. We'll take you to the hardest hit areas and tell you about the next storm that has its sights set on our area. Plus, something rushed into the cabin and then rushed out. We'll talk about a scare in the air. A piece of a plane detaches mid-flight. Incredibly, no one was seriously injured, but tonight the FAA has grounded hundreds of Boeing's 737s. And good evening to you. I'm Lauren Glasper. And I'm Joe Torres. It has been a while since plows cleared the roads and people shoveled the sidewalks. But many folks across our area will wake up tomorrow morning to several inches of snow. And this was the scene in Chestnut Ridge in Rockland County. And you can see just how fast the snow was coming down at around 8 this evening. Meanwhile, in Rockaway, New Jersey, you can see the snow piling up on this viewer's backyard table and chair and deck and in Stamford, Connecticut. South and east where temperatures are safely above the freezing mark. So mainly rain, New York City, south and east, snow north and west overnight. The brunt through about 2 o'clock in the morning and then tapering off. And then it ramps back up again a little bit. Tomorrow morning you start off with a little bit of drizzle, maybe a mix of rain and snow, and then going over to snow mid to late morning with additional inch or so north of town. Check out that future cast again. Again, as we head into the middle and latter part of tomorrow morning, all of a sudden the radar starts filling in again. So there'll be some flakes flying out there, making for a very wintry scene tomorrow, even in the areas that changed over to rainfall. Of course, that next midweek storm could be a big deal. And you know what? Danny Beckstrom will be all over that mm -hmm. early in the morning. Mm -hmm. And then we have some warm temperatures, too, in the middle of the week. So we're kind of all That's over right, the place. That's right, all over all the place. Over the That's right. All right. Thanks, Jeff. That is our news for now. We thank you for staying up with us. I'm Lauren Glassberg. And I'm Joe Torres. You want to stay with Eyewitness News as we monitor our first snowfall of the season. Meteorologist Danny Beckstrom will have updates starting later this morning when Eyewitness News returns at 6. Bundle up, stay safe, stay warm.